That feels good. Long enough. Oh, still just a good split. Almost ready. Just get it. Not that I had any say in that. Adrenaline. 
Regroup. She'll be all right, Blair. How are you feeling? Adjusting. The split is never easy. Take a moment. Ooh, ah, you all made it. Good. All in one piece. What happened to Iskarin and Dagda? Iskarin? You've probably heard rumors. Possessed. Dagda got it bad. Whatever they hit her with. Not great. And our beloved seer is... Well... I've seen Isgarin in better shape. <sighs> they fled for our own good. Apart sent his strongest to take them down first. Guess that makes you the standing chair of the wizard's court. And how are you doing? Stabilizing? I have questions. I'm sure you have many. So, Commander, let us fill you in. Oh, dear God. Oh, dear God. Let's go to Zoja. Zoja. It's been... A long time. Yeah. I'm sorry. It's been an eventful day. I suppose I'm still in shock. <laughs> I bet you are. It's good to see you. And you. We have a lot to catch up on. Here. I went back to Radisum after Maguma. They tried to help me heal, but nothing worked. It was different then. It didn't feel like home. They treated me differently. So I traveled. And I traveled and traveled until I found somewhere I belonged. They took me in, helped me heal. Been here since. The Wizard's Court keeps all of this a secret. When I left Ratasum, I just wandered for a while. I needed to be alone. I, I felt... I ran into another Asura in a hunting lodge outside Divinity's Reach. You know. I told her my story, she told me hers. Then she took me to meet Mabon. And the rest is history. Yeah, I am. Been studying under Mabon for a few years now. He saw something in me. Not just my brain, but he saw a flicker of power in me. Magic. More than just the elements. I have always been proud of being a scientist, and believe me, I still am. But I never thought there was something else in there. Waiting to come out. Sorry, I've been talking much. Like I said, this is a new experience for me. Oh, he was the old dwarf. Ah, you must be the commander Maban spoke so highly of. I guess you're about what I expected. And what did you expect? Couple more scars. Taller, maybe. <laughs> I jest. We monitor you as we monitor all magical anomalies. <laughs> Don't worry. You're one of the good ones. If you weren't, well, you'd be dead. <laughs> Possessed. It's a nasty little trick courtesy of our friends, the Cryptus. They wiggle their way into your mind. Corrupt each thought one by one until you're raw. The pain refuses to cease. And why didn't you get possessed? Well, not for lack of trying. I came pre-built with a special little ability that allows me to split in two. Can't take over my consciousness if half of it is hightailing it to the wizard's tower, can you? <laughs> I'm not, no. Ascended before the last dwarf turned. I have uh, strange feelings about that. The right. But I'm reaching for something that isn't there or behind a thick wall. Must be sounding a little woo to you, aren't I? Wizards like Maban and I are a little different from you mortals. We need it to ascend to get these powers. Separate our planes of consciousness so that we can connect to the current. In simpler terms, 
Our old self is put on a separate shelf. Our new self, our wizard selves, take over. Yeah, you must be the king of the wizards. I'm sure you have many questions for me. Quite a few. Are you... A Mersat, yes. And I'm sure that isn't the biggest shock you've received today. Wizards, the Astral Ward, traveling to wherever I was. No, it's not. I apologize if I find it hard to trust you immediately. My only experiences with the Mersat have been... Dire at best, yeah. I know. Ask whatever you need. My knowledge is yours. You've placed a lot of faith in us already. Oh god, let's go to the We are currently standing outside the Beacon of Ages. You may recognize it from folklore. Tyria dubbed it the Wizard's Folly Tower. Not our choice, of course. We have beacons such as this all over the world. They are conduits, so to say. The shield that they powered was recently broken, hence... Well, all of this. This land is ancient and sacred. High above us in the clouds lies Omnitas, our home. Unfortunately, we're barred from getting any closer until we can quell the tower's defenses. Yeah, let's keep talking. They are our protectors. While the other wizards and I kept the shields in place, the Astral Ward kept eyes on the rest of the world. Despite our best efforts, there are cracks in every system. Creatures of the mists have found ways inside. The Ward protects you from them. Every time a rift opens in Tyria, they seal it and kill whatever terror it has set loose. We are protectors, not too dissimilar from yourself and your liege, Arine. While you kept Tyria safe from the threat of the Dragon Cycle, we watched you from the clouds. Until recently, the World Spire has powered a shield that guarded this world from the mists. To an extent. The final Dragon Cycle weighed heavily on our ability to shield ourselves. Nightfall came, Balthazar. Tyria has suffered still. But when the cycle ended, the magical ecosystem was fractured, the lake stilled. And now, you can see to the bottom. Aurene has begun to restabilize the system. I can feel her at work now. But until we mend the spire and our beacons, we are blood in water. Not only to the Cryptus, but anything else that may be looking. The Cryptus are demons. They... evolved. Learned. Their influence and power grew under the guidance of their leader, Epoch. Yeah. Centuries ago, Epoch wanted to join our ranks, but Isgarin denied him entry. He found Epoch to be... ignorant. Hungry. Demons tend to be solitary creatures, but Epoch saw potential. Wells of power that they'd yet to tap into. He dubbed himself their king and built a society in his own image. One of fear and anger. Naos, the realm of dreams. They've spent centuries watching us, and others, learning all they can. Now, they've chosen to act. That was Iskarin's choice, and he made it long ago. He felt that the world only needed to focus on one terror at a time. <laughs> Though I do admit, maybe this would have been prevented if we had asked for help sooner. All the beta tester. All of your friends. Oh, oh, I gotta do it. We gotta do that. We gotta do that. It don't work. No. 
Yeah, we need and Arena. She didn't make it back. Maban focused all of his energy on grabbing the commander. If she has half the strength of her mother, I pity the cryptus that tries to put her down. Ah, yes. Glad to see you on your feet. Me too. I suppose we finally have a breath for a proper introduction. Name's Frode. Welcome to the Astral Ward. I do. Now that you've got some sense of our situation, I've set up a meet with the rest of the Rift Hunters. Rift Hunters? Are they also Astral Ward? Correct. I'll explain later. Got a camp set up nearby. I'll walk you through everything. Got it. I'll see you there soon. And there we go. The prologue. We got Flight Training Mastery. Hmm. Uh, Tower of Adventure. Rift Hunter Boot Box. Deluxe gear, five loot bags. And a mastery. Stash of astral coins. Skywatch. Ooh. Hey, I've got a job what for you. Are you. Well, you worry too much. Limited access, okay. Tell you permanently unlocked sky scale, you can only use this mount while good lords use speed of obscurity explore bros helms. Wow, we need to find out what the new track is for it, and we need to get our sky scale unlocked. So until next time guys, I hope you guys are enjoying this. Um this is gonna be one heck of a really good game. So with that said guys, hope you guys enjoy and please get this DLC. It is one of the good ones. So, 